I was thinking, like, I think part of the problem in America is that 911, people think of 911 as being instant response. And, because, like, when I was growing up in South Africa, one of my favorite TV shows I used to watch with my mom was a show called Rescue 911, right, with William Shatner. And it was like a show where they go like, 911, do you have an emergency? And I'd be like, hi, I'm in my house, and something, well. And then like 911 would get there. And I remember even when we were watching inside, we'd be like, wow, 911, 911. And this is in Africa. And we'd be like, 911. And we never thought of our numbers, because they started, they tried a thing in South Africa called uh, 10 triple one. Because they tried to be like, yeah, we've also got a thing. People were like, 10 triple one. It was like, no. <laughs> and because they try to go with that feeling. But we never thought of it as instant response. Because if you would call our like call centers, it wouldn't be as efficient. And so, like, in America, I think people are used to the fact that something will get done now. So I was thinking what you should do is, just to, like, dull it for a bit, you should bring the South African operators here. <laughs> just so that people stop thinking 911 is, like, an instant solution. Because, like, South African, like, they'll ask you questions. Like, in America, they just go, someone's getting robbed. They're like, we're on our way. Like, I heard with 911, even if you call them and then hang up, they'll come to check what happened. Which, I, I mean, I get it, but I'm also like, that's crazy. Whereas in South Africa, like if you, like if they called, if you had South African operators doing 911, like you'd call, and you'd be like, hello, there's a man at the park. And they'd be like, hello, can I help you? <laughs> they'd be like, yeah, there's a man at the park. And I'd be like, and? <laughs> be like, yeah, he, he looks really suspicious. Be like, okay, go talk to him. <laughs> Ask him what he's doing. <laughs> Ask him his name, what he's doing there. <laughs> be like, I'm scared of talking to him. Be like, okay, walk away then, go away. <laughs> like, they would just be like, you go, like, it's just, people here just like, the cops are going, no, the cops are not coming. For everything, like, hey, you can call 911 because your cat is in a tree. That is some crazy ass shit in Africa that you'd just be like, yeah, you'd be like, hello, my cat's in a tree. They'd be like, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, you'd be like, I need, what, my cat's stuck in a tree. They'd be like, yeah, so what must we do? <laughs> I need you to help it. They'd be like, then how will your cat learn? <laughs> Let the cat suffer, it will never do it again. <laughs> Thank you for calling. Please stay on so you can read this call. Thank you very much. <laughs>